What's up, you guys? My name is Mary with Love Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can uh, smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just saying. Um, I got a channel message in, so I decided to do this reading. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Okay, so the channel I received was someone um someone acquired a ppp loan using someone else's social security number they are about to be exposed in a huge 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 way for some their karmic convinced them to do it this person is not connected to this person for some it is an illegal business Okay, so ooh, so you plug it in how it resonates. So someone um, used someone else's so social security number to secure a PPP loan. Now, that channel I received right before I clicked the camera on. The other ones I just received as I was here. So I Googled PPP loan because I've heard of the PPP loan. Um, you know, there's YouTube channels to telling you how to apply for it and all, all kinds of stuff. And I've... Um, I watched a little bit of those videos, so I had a general understanding of what a PPP loan is, um, but I've never applied for one. So, um, but anyway, so I Googled it for everybody so everybody can know what a PPP loan is. Um, so everybody's on the same page, okay? So PPP loan is a government loan. Paycheck Prote Protection Program. It's an SBA-backed loan that helps businesses keep their work workforce employed during the COVID-19 crisis. Hold on. I was going to see what else that said. Okay, yeah. So PPP loan, Paycheck Protection Program, an SBA-backed loan that helps businesses keep their work workforce employed during, during the COVID-19 crisis. So it, it was during the COVID-19, um, or C-19 crisis, C-19 crisis. So, it you know, it's been recent in the universe, whoever this is for. for uh, I feel it's for at least two or more people in the universe. But whoever this is for, um, I heard they used, for some, their karmics convinced them to do it. but they secured this PPP loan with somebody's social security number that is not even connected to them in any shape, form, or fashion. So they don't communicate with them. They don't. Um, they don't communicate with them. They they don't uh, or they don't associate with them or they're not friends or or they're estranged or something of that nature. So that's the, that's the energy I'm feeling. So, but they're for some of these situations they're karmics, which is people in their life that's Terry that's blocking them in some shape form or fashion or trying to block them in some shape form or fashion um convince them to use somebody else's social security number but somebody that they're not they're estranged from or not connected with or don't they don't communicate with anymore um however that resonates um it's about to backfire in a huge 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 way oh lord Okay, I heard it's about to backfire in a huge, huge, huge way. So it's about this, um, it's about to be revealed, it sounds like, through some kind of series of chain of events. I didn't hear that part. That's just my deductive reasoning and logic on this. That it's about to backfire um, them using this person's social security number that they don't need to communicate with anymore or whatever, what have you. They're estranged from in some shape, form, or fashion. Somehow they acquired it. Now, however they acquired the social security number, I don't know. Um, obviously through sneaky deceptive methods but they did um but i heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way um i'm assuming they'll have to pay back the ppp loan now i did look that up a little bit too um and a lot of the ppp loans you you do have to pay back you do now some there's certain certain circumstances you don't have to pay it back but for a lot you do <coughs> maybe this <coughs> person or people didn't think they would have to but they're about to, and I heard it's about to basically, um, it's supposed to give them a lot of trouble, a lot of trouble, basically. Um, however, this resonates for whoever, but some kind of PPP loan, 
um, it's government loan. So I feel whoever this is for, they reside in the United States or they used to reside in the United States, however that resonates. Um, but I heard for some of these, it's illegal businesses. So it wasn't even a legal business. So I don't feel they gained a business license to obtain the business to begin with. Um, because I heard illegal businesses for some. So for some, I don't even feel they went to, you know, their local um, business license office to obtain a business license for some, because I heard illegal businesses for some. So, I mean, I mean, charge after charge after charge after charge is what I'm hearing here. You know, it's, it's, it's pretty crazy. It's pretty crazy. So let's, let's do some cards and we'll see what comes out. I heard it's about to backfire on them in a huge way because um, it's about to be, um, I feel they might get some legal communication regarding this or somebody's about to tell this person that their social security number was used for this and um, the person's going to put a lawsuit on them or people, however that resonates. But for some, it's illegal businesses. So they acquired the PPP loan to help pay their employees during the COVID-19 crisis, but some of them, or C-19 crisis, but some of them, it was an illegal business to begin with. So, I mean, what the crap, man? Spirit messages you have requested. Surrender reverse. Change upright. Yeah, wow. I'm going to get one of these. Spirit messages. Beginnings upright. Okay. So number 26, 35, or 2 might be very significant numbers in some shape, form, or fashion. 26, 35, or 2, those could be significant um, ages of you or somebody you're connected to. It could be a lottery number. It could be a jersey number. It could be... Um, a date of birth number, green card number, social security number. It could be a significant numbers you're seeing, reoccurring numbers you're seeing on billboards or advertisements, 26, 35, or 2. Surrender reverse. This person is about to be shocked. With legal communication. For some, they've already received the legal communication. Okay, uh, if this resonates. So, um, whoever this is for, I feel I'm pulling in the energy of the person or people. Is at least two or more people in the universe that's done this. Uh, for some, they've already received um, negative communi legal communication. And they're shocked and pissed. And probably, um, they're probably shocked and pissed. For some, they're about to receive it. And they're, I heard they're going to be shocked and probably pissed. So surrender reverse. They do not want to have to repay the money. They do not feel guilty or remorseful. I'm feeling because they stole someone else's social security number and for some created illegal businesses. So they, I'm feeling for some they didn't even freaking pay the licensure fee to um, have a business, which is crazy. So they don't want to give up the money, basically. They don't want to give up the money. They're about to be forced to. Through many series of chain events. Okay, I heard they're about to be forced to through, through many series of chain events. So they don't want to give up the money, man, but they're about to be forced to through many series of chain events. Change upright. For some, their karmics will leave them after this because it was all about money anyways. For some, two or more karmics. Okay. I heard for uh, some of these situations, their karmics will leave them after this situation. So after they uh, basically have to pay back all this money, uh, for some, they could go to jail or prison. Jail and then prison. I mean, this is like federal offense energy. I mean, it's it's big. So I do. I feel some of the, uh, feel whoever is about to give, some have just received, it sounds like recently received legal communication, negative legal communication. Some, they're about to. So they're about to get busted, basically. 
Um, that could be where the indictment energy is coming in for some of these people that I've been pulling in, possibly. Um, this is serious. This is real, real serious. This is not anything you're messing around with. I'm serious. Um, but whoever this is for, whoever's negative energy I'm pulling in here, um, I heard big change, a uh, big, um, sounds like series of chain events are going to cause changes here. I think it's the legal, negative legal communication for these nice, uh, nasty, shiesty PP loan, um, false PPP, PPP loan people, whoever they are. Um, so change is coming for them. I heard for some of them, their karmics are going to leave them because after all, it was, a, it was only about the money anyways. Um, for some of these people, they have two or more karmics. So they, you know, they, they have two or more relationships like polygamous relationships or third party or situationships or what have you. So changes to their relationship, changes to their money, probably the change in this situation I'm feeling is jail and then prison for some. Um, because I, I cannot imagine how in the world they would, uh, after they're being exposed and caught, how they, people would just let them roam free. Um, I mean, even Martha Stewart went to prison. I mean, even friggin' Martha Stewart. She should have, but she did. I'm just saying. Beginnings. Someone's having a huge wake up call. Okay, I heard someone's having a huge wake-up call. So you're having a huge wake-up call. If this is for you, um, I, you're having a huge wake-up call. I think about something in here or you're something in your personal life or both. How that resonates with some kind of wake-up call energy is like light bulb, bazinga, aha moment energy. How that resonates. Beginnings. Cycle changes coming with this. Definite cycle changes. Some parents will never look at their children the same way again. But they shouldn't. They're huge thieves. Oh my God. Woo. So I heard huge cycle changes coming with this. So huge cycle changes. So world card cycle change. Um, and we have the change card upright. Um, I heard some, um, some of these fever adult people are basically, um, their children, child or children, how this resonates. I heard they're never going to look at these thiever PPP loan people ever the same way again. Because um, they're about to be exposed, basically. Um, I think they're going to have to repay the money back. And they're probably going to wind up in prison. And I'm serious about that. Jail and then prison, probably. Uh, for some, they could have been already in jail. You know, um, possibly. Or a history of in and out jail. I don't know how it resonates. But basically, beginnings. Um, new beginnings here, cycle change energy. I mean, we've got change coupled with beginnings upright. Cycle change energy all over the place. Boom, boom, boom. With not wanting to give up the money, but they're about to, it, the universe is about to force this. The universe is. The universe is definitely about to force this. Okay, I heard the universe is definitely about to force this. Someone's smart decisions recently is about to force this. For these people. Okay. So you plug it in how it resonates. So I heard someone's smart decisions recently. Is about to force this cycle change. For these negative PPP loan people. How that resonates. Someone's smart decisions. And intuition. It's about to pay off in a huge way. Okay. I heard someone's smart decisions. And intuition. So if this resonates with you. The light side person here. Um, so your smart decisions and your intuition um, is about is about to pay off in a huge way. It's about to force these negative cycle changes for these people. So I feel you could be the one about to bust these people, or you could be the one that they sold the social security number from um, to secure this PPP loan. Um, however, that resonates for you. But if this resonates for you, your smart decisions and your intuition, so your gut instincts, do something, not do something, yada, or or do something in a smart manner, because I heard smart decisions. So you're doing something in a very smart manner. Um, and your I think your intuition told you to do it that specific way, but it's about to pay off in a huge way. Um, so I feel you could be the one either to bust these people, or you're the one social security number got stole, or both possibly for some. 
You plug it in how it resonates. Wow, this is powerful here. All right, I feel guided to pull, pull, a, pull a couple of these and then um, down close it. Experimented. Okay, wow, that was quick. Journey reverse, Lord upright. Let me get one more. Spirit messages you have collected. Spirit messages you have collected. Okay. So we have journey reversed, Lord upright, wedding upright, constancy reversed. Journey reverse. To the person, to the victim that had your social security number stolen, someone is about to try to keep you stuck. But they're not going to come out like they're going to try to keep you stuck. You really need to use your best intuition on this person. Romantic interest. Okay, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So the person that got their social security number um, stolen, this is for you. I heard basically uh, there's a romantic interest about to try to come into your life, if this resonates. So whoever this is for, they got your social security number stolen and this you feel like this resonates with you. Um, it's they have not come in your life yet they have not come in yet but they're about to but i heard um basically um and that could be the change in beginnings energy too but it's romantic interest but i heard they're gonna come off like they don't want to keep you stuck but they really will but i think it's because they know this information and they don't want to tell you that's exactly what i think so i heard you basically be careful Use your best intuition. So if you feel this resonates with you and you getting somebody about to enter your life, wanting to be romantic, well, I heard they're going to come off. Uh, you're single, whoever this is for. I feel you're single. Be your, feel you're single as a Pringle. Um, I heard they're going to come in like they don't want to keep you stuck. So I think they're going to come in very nonchalantly. They're going to want, um, probably want you to be the only one they want to be with or tell you you're the only one they want to be with or like a friends would, or, and then tell you, well, you can do it, but you have free will. You can choose to do whatever you want to do. We're not really, you know, I like to be together, but we don't have to be. Trying to make it like you have a choice, but in reality, they only want to be with you. In reality, they know this information. They most certainly do that know this information. You need to be careful. Oh, God. Okay. That's confirmation from spirit. Oh, my God. Okay. Yeah. So I heard they do know this information. They do. They do know this information, but they're not going to tell you. But they want to be with you romantically and sexually. Yeah. So this is them making you feel like you're not stuck. But in reality, you are because they know this information. But somebody else knows this. And it's about to create um, it's about to create universal change regardless. So whoever this is for, this is a specific romantic interest about to try in your life. They want your pants, but they don't want to get um, give you the information on this. Somebody stole your, your money, basically. Well, it's not, it's not your money. It's not, it wasn't even your money. It was your social security number. But they stole, they did technically steal money from you. Yes, they stole money from you. Um, but it might not have been, for some, you might not even should have got the money to begin with. Maybe, for some. I mean, you plug it in how it resonates. But they know about the theft of the social security number fraud, basically. But they're not. They just want your pants. So just be careful, basically. Lord upright. But they're going to come off like you have choices and you're single and you can go do be wh wh whoever you want to be. But I only want to be with you, like pulling your heartstrings. Lord, up Lord upright. They're secretly very controlling. For some, you will pick up on this. For some, you will not even engage like that oh my god okay i heard for some they're secretly controlling for some you're not um gonna you're gonna pick up on it so you're gonna your intuition is gonna peak you're gonna pick up on they're secretly controlling and you'll probably cut it off 
for some, you're not even going to engage with them like that. So you're not even going to engage romantically or flirtatiously or whatever with them like that. You're just going to, I mean, however you deal with them. It's someone about to enter your life, though, whoever this is for. They haven't entered, entered yet. In a romantic sense, in a romantic sense, I will tell you that. Now, for some, it could be somebody you already know, and they're going to come off romantically to you. Um, for some, it's a brand new person, and they're going to come in romantically. That's the way I feel it can go, both of those ways. So they haven't revealed their feelings romantically. So for some, they could already be in your life, and they're about to reveal their feelings romantically. For some, it's a brand new person. But new romantic feelings. But they know your social security number is stolen. They don't have them. Um, for some, I feel it's a masculine energy, or it can be a fan that takes on heavy masculine. They're coming up as Lord Upright. But um, they don't want to be honest and chivalrous and tell you the truth, basically. But they want your fingers. Wedding Upright. Some they know about a fraudulent marriage and some they eventually want to marry you. Okay. Her, for some of these people, they know about a fraudulent marriage and for some they um, secretly want to marry you. So wedding upright. So for some of these people, these lords upright about to enter your life, either a new person or a person you've known for forever that's about to try to enter in romantically. Um, they want in your pants but don't want to tell you the truth, basically. For some, they know about a fraudulent marriage, and for some, they um, they want to marry you down the line, but they don't want to tell you the truth. Wow. Constancy reversed. This person is very inconsistent, but you're about to pick up on this. Okay, I heard this person is very inconsistent, but you're about to pick up on it. Now, inconsistent means um, that they basically don't keep their word, or they um, say one thing and do another, or they're like wishy-washy, however that resonates. That's like inconsistency energy. You plug it in how it resonates. They're not like huge change effectors in positive ways, basically. That's the energy I'm feeling. Possibly. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. For a lot, you will dead this shit. Have had huge awakenings. And let the process take its place and let these people get caught. Okay, so you, oops, okay. So I heard for a lot of you guys, you're going to dead this shit, basically. You're going to dead this person, romantic interest about to try to come in your life. Whether you've known them for a hot minute or you haven't, you're about to dead this, um, however this resonates. You're highly intuitive, and for some of you, Brady, you've had great awakenings recently, so your intuition's at peak, and you basically, you've had a huge wake-up call, and you are just about like, zing up. So you're not interested in this person, but they're trying to come in, I think, to block this information. I heard basically if you what it sounds like from the messages is, is, is if you block this person and you have enough strength and self power in yourself to block this person out of your life like romantically for some you might have to deal with them on other realms you know like a neighbor or a co-worker etc etc but if you just block them romantically I heard let the universe do its work and these buttheads will basically get caught so Blocking this person romantically out of your life, upcoming um, romantical feelings and blotty, 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 but they don't want to tell you truth. So obviously, they don't respect you enough to tell you truth. But if you block this person out romantically, let the universe do its work because behind the scenes, the universe is about to do some huge things for you for this. If this, if you feel this resonates for you. But blocking this person out romantically is important, it sounds like, if you feel this resonates for you. So you can get your blessings. That's exactly what I'm feeling. Because somebody has frauded you. So you don't want to be accused of a crime. You don't want to be, um, 
you know, you don't want to be held liable for something that somebody else did, basically. They use your social security number for a freaking PPP loan. That's huge. That is huge. That's fraud and that's theft and that's huge. So you don't want to be accused of this, basically. So if you feel this resonates with you. It is going to be exposed soon. Keep doing you. Making smart decisions. Okay, I heard it's going to be exposed soon. Keep doing you and making smart decisions. So if this resonates with you, I heard basically keep doing you. So this person would not be good for you if you feel this person resonates with you or this situation resonates with you. And basically keep doing you and let the universe do its work because this is behind the scenes. Sounds like it's about to basically blow it all to hell. It's about to come out. But it's going to be good for you that it comes out. But protect yourself from this person because they don't respect you enough to even tell you the truth, basically. That's what I'm feeling. All right, you guys. I think we're done. Let me see if I hear anything else. Lawsuits are coming in this. Definite lawsuits. Okay, I heard lawsuits are coming in this. Definite lawsuits. So, lawsuits are coming in this. Definite lawsuits. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. It might be the government putting a lawsuit on this butthead. It might be, or buttheads. It might be... Um, you finding this information out and putting a lawsuit on this butthead or buttheads, whether it's one or several people, I think it's, um, it, some is illegal business. So, I mean, they were paying employees with an illegal business with your, your social security number and money that they applied for that they shouldn't have even applied for under your social security number. So, I mean, there's many people involved in this is what I'm trying to say. It's really sad. Uh, but I would basically just keep doing you. Keep doing you. Make smart decisions. Let the universe do its dirty work, basically. All right. I love you guys. Hope this helped. Namaste. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash app. Move Venmo. Single mom with two kids. That really helps. Love you guys. Namaste.